So Sean, start of the season and a kind of photo call for, for the club. What are your expectations for the club and have you settled in so far? Um, settled in pretty well. I think all the lads have, have gelled really well, very fast. So it's been um, it's been a good pre-season. It's been a, you know we've got a good few results and everyone's really positive to start on Saturday. And you know I think the fans they're expecting big things from us this season. What with Liam bringing a lot of new faces in and you know there's there's quite a bit of hype around us to do well. So. I think we've just got to back it up and go and do the business starting Saturday. And do you think that, you know, the expectation and, and I think they'll tell for the favourites with most of the bookmakers to get promoted, does that put extra pressure on you as players individually? Or? It, it puts a bit of pressure on players because, you know, if you don't if you don't live up to all the, um, as I said before, all the hype of people saying you should win the league or you've got the tools to win the league, then it does, it does put a bit of pressure on you. But, you know, it, it just comes as part of the job and you've just got to get on with it and, We've got a job to do on the pitch, and that's our main focus to pick up the points and obviously get back into the league, into the conference. And I think with the, you know with the kind of the ground and the setup behind the scenes here and stuff, it's Telford's probably going to be seen as one of the biggest scouts in the league this season, I guess, and maybe puts kind of a bit more pressure on on kind of certainly home games, I guess. I suppose. Yeah, I think when people turn up and they see the facilities here, you know, they're, they're fantastic. They shouldn't be in in a division such as where we are. So I think people come here, they, they, they like to play against us. And as you say, the people will see us as a scout next year and everyone will, will want to come and will want to beat us. So we've got to be on our game more so at home even than, than going away when it's tough. It's going to be tough everywhere for us next year. But it seems to be a nice relaxed atmosphere around kind of between all the guys and with Liam and Dom and stuff. And I think obviously that helps kind of generate a good team spirit. Yeah, well, you know, it, Liam's Liam and Dom's attitude is that the, the main thing is is um, is getting the results and, and being professional, but they do it in, in such a way where the lads can can you know relax and, and get together and and focus rather than there being there's, there's there's no tension, there's no um, there's always positive around the chain and around the chain of pitch and around a match day. So hopefully, as I say, we've had a good pre-season. We just want to use it as our um, to kick on now. Fantastic. And just talking of pre-season, obviously like kind of the, the last time result against Bangor, four 0 win, kind of both yeah. the two forwards getting a couple of goals apiece and, and a clean sheet. Seems to be goals all around the team. Yeah, yeah. I think there's a there's quite a few players that are gonna uh, chip in this year. You can tell it's gonna be a few goals from not just sometimes teams rely on on a sole player to, to get the goals, but I think there's there's plenty in the dressing room that can get on the score sheet and obviously they're gonna contribute to, to some some points on the board so yeah it's, it's it's a good squad I'm happy with the players that have been brought in and I mean, I'm looking forward to it Fantastic and then just finally have you set yourself any kind of personal targets? Yeah I, I, I want to chip in myself with the goals and I'm I'm, uh, I'm looking forward to that as well so I've um, that's my personal goal just get, a, get on the score sheet as much as I can and do my part for the team